So I really do think it's time just to, to say, look, this is, we have a book. It says this. If you believe the book, that's good. We're on the same team. If you say, yeah, I believe the book, but because of the position I'm in, you know, I really can't say much, then, you know, go get a different kind of job. I still hadn't checked on my Twitter, you know. Good. You told me not to. I read Jerry's Twitter. I ain't read mine. Got people texting me all over the nation saying, what happened? Can I talk to you? What happened? I'll tell you what happened. What happened? We've been played. We've been played. What do you think makes the SBC the best denomination in America? Our, our stances on uh, uh, just just. I'm going to put it just simply put that we stick to what the scripture has to tell us, and we don't we don't we don't budge from that. We're I'm, I'm grateful that I'm I'm not seeing the SBC do what some conventions are doing in terms of uh, stepping away from their 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 values and stances on biblical uh, hot button topics. Yeah. I'll put it that way. Yeah. <laughs> so speaking of biblical hot button topics, that relates right to my next question and talking about, I'm sure you've seen the chatter on Twitter and just conversations that have been going around about women pastors and women preachers and the woman being the president of the SBC. What are your thoughts on that? How do you feel about a woman being president of the SBC? I don't know that I have a comment on that, honestly. Okay. Yeah, what do you think scripture speaks on women preachers or pastors? Would you be willing to talk about that at all? I'd say the Bible does. The Bible does speak upon it. Um, since I'm honestly representing Lifeway, yeah. um, I'd rather let Lifeway answer that Absolutely. question. Absolutely. I appreciate your time so much, Rob. Thank you so much. It was great to meet you.